What's going on guys, it's Channing, and today we're going to unbox this bad boy. Barely fits in the frame, but it's pretty exciting. I've seen plenty of videos, people talking about how big it is, and we're really going to see just how big it is. But yeah, today we're going to unbox it. Let's get into it. I wasn't originally going to unbox the PlayStation 5, but I decided I'm going to go ahead and at least for myself unbox it so I have that memory on camera. I did unbox the original PlayStation 4 when it came out seven years ago, I think 2013. And uh, that unboxing is actually on the channel. That was on launch day. I got this uh, two days after launch. Target shipped it to me on uh, Saturday. So we're a little bit behind launch day. So it's not actually launch day. But I'm still going to unbox it for myself. And then of course you guys are here to uh, witness my excitement. So let's get right into it. So like I said, of course, obviously the box is huge. Barely fits in the frame. And I'm sure you've probably watched some unboxings of this as well. So, first off, we've got a box inside of a box. Well, a box inside of a sleeve, rather. I'm going to open it this way so you can see it like this. Oh, we've got like a top box here. So, we've got all the literature, starting guide, setup guide. We've got the controller. I already know how the controller feels because I actually bought a second one. And it arrived weeks ago from Amazon. And this one is, of course, exactly the same. The DualSense controller. Got the power cable. Of course, that's important. We've got the base, which I will be using. I've seen a lot of people just standing them vertically without the base, but I'm going to go ahead and use the base. They included it. And then we actually have an HDMI 2.1 cable, I believe. I believe this is a 2.1. I actually have one of those as well already that I will probably use. But if this is an HDMI 2.1 cable, it's nice to think of it today. All right, here it comes. Oh boy. Okay, first impressions is holy cow. It is a lot bigger than I thought. I, I saw people saying it was big, but wow. Wow. That thing is massive. That is absolutely massive. So I saw people saying online in the videos that it was massive, but I guess you really just don't realize how big it is until you see it. Obviously, it's not the same size as like a gaming PC. My gaming PC is a lot bigger than this. Uh, I also have an NZXT H1, which is a square, it looks like a Xbox One, it's in that rec rectangle square form. It's taller than the Xbox One, it's a little bit bigger, but compared to other consoles that we already have out, this thing, this thing is big. Like, wow. That's pretty awesome. So there it is guys, the PlayStation 5 unboxing. And uh, I, I have had some people asking me already, some of my friends have already asked what game I'm going to play first. And I'm going to be honest, it's Spider-Man Miles Morales. I'll probably play the remaster first, and then I will play Miles Morales. If I believe correctly from my research, I can actually play the uh, original Spider-Man remastered. And it has a whole nother set of trophies, including a platinum. So that could be another platinum that I get. I've already platinum the original Spider-Man on PlayStation 4. If my research is correct, I can platinum it again and as the remastered version. And then I'd have another platinum, which is pretty awesome. So I'm going to play Spider-Man Miles Morales, the DualSense. They said the DualSense kind of gimmicky on Spider-Man, but other games, it's absolutely amazing. Anyways, guys, now I'm just rambling. Thank you for coming and watching. If you're new here and you like this type of content, make sure you subscribe. Make sure you give it a like if you liked it. I guess that other button, if you didn't, works fine as well. And as always, this is your host, Channing, and I'm out. Peace. <laughs>